Hi, my name is Cynthia, and I would like to present my final microbiology project. Procaryotes are a single cell organism that do not carry their genetic material in a distinct nucleus. Contain ribosomes, is an uncellular organism, and do not have a membrane bound organelle. Bacteria are prokaryotes. Eukaryotes may be single cell or multicellular organisms with carrying their genetic material in the form of chromosomes inside of a distinct nucleus. They have organelles with carry out a specific cell function. Fungi are example of eukaryotes that can be single cell or multicellular organism. All multicellular organisms are eukaryotes, including humans. Viruses are not cellular organisms. They are packets of genetic material and proteins without any of the structure that distinct prokaryotes and eukaryotes. No nucleus, do not have a membrane about organelles, cannot reproduce by themselves, and too small to be seen with light microscope. Scientific name is Propione bacterium acnes and belongs to the family of Propione bacterium chi. The species is widely common cell and it is one of the main normal residents of human skin. It is also found in the oral cavity, large intestine, conjunctive, and external auditory canal. Propione bacterial acnes is ubiquitous, slow growing, road shaped, no sporing form gram-positive anaerobic bacteria. The disease caused by this bacterium is acne. Acne is an inflammatory skin condition that occurs when sebum, oil, and dead skin cells block the pore open, causing sebum to build up inside the pore. Although acne is a common skin condition, if left untreated, it can lead to severe inflammation and permanent scarring. There are three stages. The first is mild, where there are small pancreas, black heads, open comedo, and white heads, close comedo, and no inflammation. The second stage is the moderate one, where there is in the presence of black heads, papulus, and pustulus. There is mild inflammation, and the appearance of acne can occur from the face to other areas. And the last stage is the severe stage, where there is inflammation, severus papus appear, and there is also the presence of cystic pustulus of nodules, high risk of scarring, and post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation. There are many reasons for the appearances of acne, such as hormones, menstruation, emotional stress, genetic disease of the gastrointestinal tract, overactive oil glands, high glycemic index food, and medication. Propionibacterium acne are bacteria that are routinely present on the skin. It isn't passed from person to person. The 
which is a treatment line where topical therapy, oral therapy, and antibiotic are used. As we can see, if the station is mild, the use of topical retinoid, such as benzoline peroxide, is recommended. And we can also include a topical antibiotic. If successful, continue treatment with topical retinoids only. Otherwise, start the recommended treatment for stage 2, which is the moderation stage, and so on. There is still no vaccine to prevent the onset of acne. Scientific name is Malassezia purple and belongs to the family of Malassezia. Malassezia purple is a fungus that lives on the superficial layers of the dermis. It generally exists as a common cell organism forming a natural part of the human skin microbiota, but it can gain pathogenic capabilities when morphed from a yeast to a hypho form during its life cycle. Through you know molecular chains, it is associated with a variety of dermatological conditions caused by fungal infections, notably seborrhea dermatitis and pineus versicolor. Malassezia forth is an unicellular organism which varies in size. The cells have a bottle-like shape to a small protrusion visible at the end of each cell. Malassezia full forms filaments when it's become its pathogenic form. Like most of its genus, Malassezia full is a lipophilic yeast meaning it requires an environment high in fats and oil to flourish. Who gets tinea versicolor? Anyone can develop tinea versicolor, though it's more common in young adults. Their fungus that causes tinea versicolor can be found on healthy skin. It only starts causing problems when the fungus overgrows. A number of factors may trigger their this growth, including hot, humid weather, oil skin, hormonal changes, and recognized immune system. The symptoms are spots of discoloration of the skin usually on the back, chest, neck, and arms, with men's appear lighter or darker than normal, milk itching, and scarring. Treatment. Both topical and oral antifungals are effective agents in the treatment of malassezia purple. Oral antifungals have the advantage of dramatic, mediate clearing of the lesion and are the most effective treatment. Patients have been successfully treated with oral pulse itraconazole and weekly fluconazole. Its name is Mobile virus measles and belongs to the family of Paramyxoviridae. 
This old virus is spherical and has two major structural components. One is the helical ribonucleoprotein, RNP4, formed by the association of the nucleoprotein, phosphor protein, and large protein with the viral genome. The other is the cellular, membrane derived lipid envelope surround the RNP4. The muso virus has two glycoprotein spikes that play a significant role in the pathogenesis. F, fusion protein, and H, hemagglutin protein. Fusion protein are responsible for the fusion of the virus with host cell membranes and viral penetration. Hemagglutin protein are responsible for the binding of the virus to cells and it is antigen against with neutralizing antibody R format. Large protein and nucleoprotein together form the nucleocapsid that cover the viral RNA. The viral genome is no segmented, negative sense, single stranded RNA and no animal res reservoir. Symptoms Some of the four telltale signs that a person has the measles start like a flu, and including hanging coffee, low grade fever run nose and sore throat. Eyes may become red and watery, and measles patient may be sensitive to light. Measles incubates in the body of about 7 to 14 days. So, the symptoms won't show up until a week or two after a person is exposed. And sick people can infect others for four days before their rats show up. Make it tough to know for sure if you have been exposed. After two or three days, thin red and white spots may show up and an infected person's check, cleaning, and the only their tongue. These are colored coplic spots, and they are a hallmark of measles. Then, after three or five, three to five days, wow! Symptoms. Some of the four telltale signs that a person has the measles start like the flu, and including a hanging coughing, low grade fever, run nose, and sore throat. Eyes may become red and watery, and the measles patient may be sensitive to light. Measles incubates in the body for about 7 to 14 days. So, the symptoms won't show up until a week or two after a person is exposed. And sick people can infect others for four days before their red show up. Make it strong to know for sure if you have been exposed. After two or three days, teeny red and white spot may show up in an infected person taking lean and the own their tongue. These are colored coplic spots, and they are a hallmark of measles. Then, after three to five days, measles patient develop a red of each red 
spots. The red usually begins with flat red spots that appear on the face. Below and in front of the ear, near the hindline and on the neck. Then it spreads down to the doors, arm, legs and feet. The spots may be feel bumpy and generally start joining together as they spread across the body. This is the phase of illness when a fever can run dangerously high, over 104 degrees Fahrenheit. Transmission. Measles is one of the most contagious of all infectious diseases. Up to 9 out of 10 susceptible persons with close contact to measles, patient will develop measles. Measles virus is primarily transmitted by respiratory droplets over short stems and less commonly by a small particular aerosol that remain suspended in the air for long period of time. The virus replicate in the respiratory tract and then spread to the local lymphatic tissues. Treatment. There is no medication prescribed for measles. However, paracetamol or ibuprofen can be used to reduce fever. It is important to rest to help boost your immune system. Drink a breathing of a fluid, use a humidifier to relieve coffee and sore throat, and vitamin A supplements can help as well. Prevent and control. The meso vaccine is the most commonly administered as a part of a combination of live attenuate vaccine that include measles, mump, rubella, and varicella, MMRV, or measles, mumps, and rubella, MMR. This vaccine contains retinate or killed forms of the virus, which stimulate the body's immune systems to recognize this virus as foreign. Therefore, the immune system can more easily identify and kill any of these viruses that it encounters in the future.